Hello all. Here, I will be telling you how to create a faded effect on images to get them merge in the backgrounds while working in Adobe Illustrator. By learning this Illustrator trick you will be able to make awesome brochures, flyers, and banners as your images will merge in the backgrounds. Using the same method you will also be able to make image collages in Illustrator. This is the image I have chosen, and following the process we will create a beautiful Happy Women's Day card, source file of which you can download from the link given in the video description. So let's start, first using rectangle tool, draw a rectangle on the artboard that will serve as our background. Now right click, arrange, send to back. The background now appears behind the image. Using the eyedropper tool or from color panel, choose any color for the background. Now you see that it appears to be a solid difference between the image and the background. We have to create a faded effect on image in such a way the image looks incorporated in the background in a very nice way. To do this, select the image using selection tool, go to, transparency panel. Here you see your image is showing along with an empty block on the right side. Moving cursor to the block, it says, double click to create or edit opacity mask. Double click on it and you will notice your image disappears from the canvas, don't worry, it will reappear. Now select rectangle tool from the toolbar and start creating a rectangle just above your image, if you don't judge where your image starts, just switch to wireframe view using ctrl plus y and you will see your image outline. Once rectangle is created, you have noticed on switching to preview mode again using ctrl plus y that the image appears but in a different color and opacity. Go to gradient panel and select black and white gradient to apply on the opacity mask. Now press G to show the gradient annotator, change the angle on the position where you want to fade in the background and you are done. See how it looks amazing while incorporated in the background. When you are done, again from transparency panel, Click on image to stop editing on opacity mask and you have your faded image that can be used with any background color or image. After this, we will create a women's day card using this faded image. Select the background image and choose a proper color. You can try on different colors to see which looks good. Now write a text. Happy Women's Day. Make it bigger. Choose a good font from your fonts library. You can select different fonts to see how it looks on the card. This font looks good. Now enlarge the text and make it align center of the artboard. Choose a good color for the text.
and you are done with a beautiful Happy Women's Day card using a faded effect on image. You can also create beautiful image collages you the same method in Illustrator. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more great tutorials, tips, and tricks of Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Illustrator and other design tools. Visit our website www.creativealleys.com for free graphic design resources including vectors, PSD mockups, web templates, fonts, icons, and more.